Located five kilometers from Zigona Valley and set on a four-acre piece of land, the development offers between three to four bedroom villas in three different house designs for between 12 million Kenya shillings and 16 million shillings. Each of the 30 homes to be completed by July next year sits approximately a tenth of an acre piece of land. The proprietors of Siren Valley Properties Limited since March 2012 have sold 50% of their homes so far. One is a three-bedroom jet villa, which is going for 11.95 million, but that particular unit has been sold out. We also have the urban, which is a four-bedroom, and this one is going for 14.95 million. And the largest, which is a four-bedroom deluxe, is going for 15.95 million. Today, they were putting in the state's infrastructure and held their groundbreaking ceremony. However, they admit the accomplishment of their dream could not have come were it not for their determination. We approached 12 different banks, most of whom refused to support the project. They focused on our early stage career and assets that we had rather than on the project itself as we had envisioned. None of us uh, come from families where the names of our relatives will be able to bring us support. The development funds for up to 60% of the total cost of the project, which totals up to 350 million Kenya shillings, an alternative source of funding that has cautioned the young investors from the still prevailing high interest lending rates. We partnered with African Development Bank and as my colleague mentioned earlier, they looked at the fundamentals of the project. Um, and that they were actually quite supportive and have been and uh, proven to be quite um, a partner. Roughly we're looking at a project size of about 350 million. So we were able to get about 200 million from the bank and the rest we put in. In offering opportunities to small vanguard of youth investors, Carol Karaoke, the managing director of KCB SNL Mortgage, said that youth can now access funds to purchase actual real estate assets, either as individuals or investment groups, for rentals, trade properties, or to become developers or trade rates through the Nairobi Securities Exchange. She added that the buyers of the houses could receive a 90% mortgage for a period of 25 years. Violet Makindo, GBS News.